Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. Thank you for taking the time out of your day to stop back at my channel. Okay, today's video is all about the embellishment swap box um, that I am hosting. Um, I am going to stop taking names actually on April the 9th, just so that you guys know, because we do have a lot of people um, already, and there's quite a few people that want two partners, so I was very excited about that. Um, this video is just to update you guys on the swap box and how the swap box is going to work. There's been a lot of questions about that. So I'm going to have a video up on April the 15th with everybody who I partner together. And on that video, you're going to respond saying, I saw the video and you're going to leave your email address on the comments section so that that way your partner can email you they saw that you left a comment on there so they'll be able to email you and then you guys will talk about how you want to do your swap box what you want to put in your swap box um, and about the swap box I I didn't put a thing that you need to have certain things in your swap box only because there's things that I don't have in my craft room like I don't collect charms I just don't do that I don't have charms and I see some people um want charms in their swap boxes so that's why I left it up to you guys what you want to do if you want to have like a color theme or a vintage theme or you guys you, you guys can talk about what kind of box that you want my thing is um I, want, I have a lot of stuff in my craft room, a lot of stuff, um, a lot of stuff that I don't really use and this way I can share it with people that I know will use it. Um, I got these months ago, months and months and months ago and I don't really use them that much. I got them because I like certain pieces in there but there's pieces like these because I don't do a lot of planning so there's pieces like that that I know that I'm not going to use. Um, if you're a planner, um, the great idea I had if you're a planner you could make your swap box all around planning you know like for your planner you can put stuff in here that a planner would use for their uh, for their um, planner if you like um, more buttons and things like that you could do that um, I have a lot of die cuts so like these little drawers that I got from the Dollar Tree they're all filled with um, with little not die cuts but little punches that I have I have a I have tons of punches so what I did one day is I just sat and I punched a bunch out and I do this to so that I can just grab them and these are all flowers and then these ones are just hello. There's a ton of hellos in there. Um, but so what I did one day is I just sat there with some paper that I had and I just punched them out and now it's good to go. I have all these so if I ever need them, I could just grab them and go. Now I have buttons, I collect buttons. So I love buttons. I don't know why I like buttons so much, but I do. But like I have these buttons. I got that, um, if you ever see that at uh, Hobby Lobby, it's the uh, grab a button bag. And I got, I got two of them one time and I have tons of buttons. So, and also I did a swap once and um, the lady was so kind. That she's like, uh, she said, well, what do you like? And I love buttons. So she sent me some of these vintage old buttons. I mean, this one looks like wood and stuff. I mean, these are like great little, I love these kind of things. Like, you know what I mean? I think it's really fun. They are fun. However, as you see, I didn't really use a lot of them. <laughs> so I, I need to use them. Um, my friend, um, my friend uh, Trish, uh, Mama Two Boys, one time sent me a wonderful little package, and she sent me all these like little wooden pieces, and these are from Michaels or Target, I, either Michaels or Target. So I cut the strips out, and I have all these, but like I haven't used them, so I really want to be able to um, to use them, and what better way than like like. I mean, I don't know, but look at this. Is that not the cutest little thing? It's a metal piece. But what what a better way than to um, share them with somebody in a swap box. You know what I mean? Um, and one time, I love sometimes to... I, I'm not feeling so good, but I want to craft. I want to do something, something crafty. So in this little thing, this is from the Dollar Tree. And this little thing, what I did is I just sat one day and I made all kinds of these cute little 
rosettes like you know what I mean so I have a ton of those that I can go and I could put in into you know they're not perfect I'm gonna tell you right now they're not perfect they're just handmade I mean and what better thing is that than having handmade handmade um, things you know like this is a little ow so I mean they're not perfect but you know they they are handy I made this one for Halloween <laughs> that's cute but like there's a bunch of little stuff in here like you know that I have I would love to share with people so you know they're, they're just some of the ideas that I have I mean you could do pom-poms um, these little bows they came from the Dollar Tree I still have these from how long ago that they were so popular um, you could do little pieces of ribbon. I mean, I know people love to get ribbon, so I plan on sharing some of my ribbon with people. You could do... Now, I I made these little things, and I love these little things. So, I'll be actually doing a DIY with this. Um, let's see. So, here, I made these little flowers out of yarn. I have this little thing that you can make them. I did some ribbon ones. So, I mean, handmade stuff like that is great to be able to share with friends. Um, you can then share some pearls. I have these. These are all, like, I cut them in little sizes that I could fit them in here. And you could share those with people. Um, I plan on making my own sequins mix. So... Here's the little mix that I will be using. This is some of the example of the mix I will be doing. Um, you know, just fun little stuff. I just want you guys to make it fun. Um, some people said to me that they don't have this little stuff here, this little crinkle stuff. Um, I saw that uh, Lisa Goss over at Happy Crafter, Lisa Goss, she did her, she made a box, she did it, a video on it, and what she did with her box is she took cray paper, and she cut cray paper up, and then mixed the colors, and put it in at the bottom, that was a really cute idea, so that's just an idea for you, and as the boxes go, you can either use this n nice box, um, this one has nine compartments in it and this one has 12 compartments in it it is up to you um, what you guys want to do to me I just want you guys to have fun and I want it to be as inexpensive as possible like I don't want you to go out and buy something special to do it do whatever is in your craft room um, swap whatever is in your craft room whatever you feel that you know you can either make rosettes you can you know punch out stuff and make little tags and things like that I want you to have fun I don't want this to be an expensive thing I want it to just be a fun crafting project um, and about when the date, when I said May 15th, I mean everybody needs to have their boxes by May the 15th. So if you get done your box, say you get your partner on the 15th of April and you're done the next day, you can send it out. Just make sure everybody has their boxes by May the 15th. So by May the 15th. Okay, so that is when I want everybody to be, to have received their box. Um, if you don't hear from your partner, please email me. Um, give them a couple of days because I know not everybody watches videos every single day. But so... Um, just give me an email if you don't hear from your partner. I will try to reach out to them and see what's going on. And if for any reason um, somebody drops out and that can't do it, um, please email me. Let me know so that either I can take the place. I do have a couple people that do want to swap with two different people. So please let me know if you um, just can't do it or something came up or you're in another swap or something and you forgot about this one. Just let me know. Um, so far we have 47 people. Um, so I'm very excited about that. Um, I'm really excited that 47 people decided to do it. That's to me that's amazing so guys please just make it fun do whatever you would like to do um, please talk with your partner have communication if you guys want to do a, a certain color or a certain theme like vintage or you know like Disney or something that's up to you and your partner to do um, 
but just be respectful of each other make sure that you do uh, communicate with each other and I do want to thank you guys all so so much for joining in on my very first um, embellishment box swap if this does really good and we do really good I'm planning on making it like maybe every other month we might do one that would be really fun and don't forget in June, the month of my birthday, I'm going to be doing four of these little cuties and I'm going to give one away a week. So make sure you stay tuned for that. All right, guys, I want to make this a short video, but it's a little bit long. So forgive me, but I just wanted to explain some things. If you have any questions, please email me and you'll see the email address down here. Email me with any of your concerns, questions, or comments. You can surely email me. I'm always answering my emails. Um... And thank you so, so much for joining in on a fun. It was, it's really great. I cannot believe how many people joined. So I'm very excited about it. Um, me personally, I am going to take two um, partners. So I'm very excited about that. But if somebody does drop out, I will be more than happy to pick up for someone. Um, and then if somebody does drop out, I will be um, putting up another video and asking anybody if they would like an extra partner or whatever. So I hope, hopefully nobody drops out. <laughs> so far, nobody has. So, but thank you so much, guys. I'm making this a little bit long and I'm rambling on. So I'm going to let you all go. Like I always say, somehow, some way, I'll have an amazing day. You make your day amazing and together, friends, we'll have an amazing day. I'll see you in my next video. Bye, guys.